Hello friends, welcome to UA Infotech channel. So in this session, we would like to explain uh, comparison operators in JavaScript. Okay, so comparison operator, it just compares the operands. Okay, and it returns the logical value. So based upon whether this uh, comparison is true or false. Okay, the operands can be, we will take uh, numericals, strings, logicals, or object values. Okay, so strings based upon the standard uh, lexographic uh, graphical ordering and also we use some uh, unicode values so in the most of uh, cases okay we can use uh, two operands for using this comparison operators okay in comparison operators uh, we have uh, so we have equal operators is uh, okay so this is uh, we can consider as uh, abstract equality okay it returns true when the operands are equal okay if it it returns it returns true and the operands equal to operands are equal okay next we have um, not equal operator not equal operator okay so we will write here like this so this is a abstract not equal okay so we can call it as abstract equality operator this is abstract not equal to operator okay it, it returns true if the operands are not equal okay the both uh, both operands is not equal it written true suppose say example like a uh, var okay so var 1 not equal to 4 okay and um, var 2 Bad to not equal to string. If you compare these three values, this compare this bar one and bar two, so we may get a true symbol because we are writing here not. Okay, and we have a strict equality. Strict equal operator. For strict equal operator, okay. So it is strictly compare. Okay, it returns true when the operands are equal and they are on the same type. Okay, so we need to mention the same type of an uh, whether it is a numerical, whether it is a string, whether it is an object. Okay, both operands are the same type. Okay, then and then only it will give you a true value for the strict equal. So for strict equality operators, we have a uh, okay triple equal to, and not strict talk operator. So not strict, strict, not equal operator. For strict not equal operator, so we may take your, okay, like this. So this is a not strict operator. So if it is written true, the operands are the same type, okay, but not equal, okay. The both operands are same type but it is not equal then it will uh, it will returns true value okay not equal is shows a, a true value here and we have a greater than greater than operator okay this is a greater than and we have greater than or equal to okay so and we have a less than or equal, less less than and less than or equal to okay so like we have a comparison operators here let me see an examples okay let me compare with uh, equal sign so abstract equality go to this visual studio create new file now you can save the file with the uh, comparison operator comparison operators uh, dot html So let me write here comparison operator. H1 comparison operator. And I'm taking here a style tag. H1 background color, deep pink. 
color white padding 20 pixels right click let me open in default browser okay so for this uh, I'm trying to create here a script tag okay so for script so here first we will go with abstract equality for abstract equality we have a double equal to operator okay double equal to so here uh, I may I may take here an example console console dot log so i may compare here 10 equal to equal to 10 okay so the expected value output is true value for this true just go to this reload this right click open in inspect okay go to this console part okay so you may get here true value the same thing so this is a numerical uh, literal we are comparing the numerical values okay then i'm comparing here console.log okay so i may compare here string literals so let me add here hello js equal to equal to Apologies. okay so it may expect a true value here so go to this just reload this page okay so we'll get a true value here the same thing so next time taking here one string value one numerical value so here I'm taking console.log I'm taking this 20 this constant be string and equal to the 20 value now let me go to this console just reload this page so we may get true value here okay and the same thing i may take here one uh, console.log okay so i'm taking the zero value zero i'll just compare to boolean value like a false condition so it may expect true also okay so like we use here okay abstract equality okay if it is true when both our prints are reference to the same object okay and if it is a string it return true the both our prints have the same characters in the same order okay if it is a number it returns true when both our prints have the same value plus 0 to minus v okay let me compare so what happen if i write here hello javascript let me go to this serial of this page it may give you false because hello js is not uh, same for hello javascript okay if it, it returns true only the uh, same characters and same type will be there in the abstract equality okay next we have abstract not equality as well for not equal let me take an example console.log okay so i may take here 40 not abstract equality 40 okay so it may return false okay because both uh, 40 is the same value but you are uh, mentioned here not strict equality so you may get here false so go to this just reload this page console is not open one second so here I'm going to take here small letters. So we'll get here false. 
the same thing console.log okay so i may take here ui infotech ui infotech equal to equal to i'm taking the same here okay when you print this one we may get here two value okay the same thing i'm using here not strict operator so not abstract equality so we'll get here false condition so it will change to the false the same um, i'm taking one more example so let me compare with the console.log console.log okay so here so i may take string value okay not equal to 30 okay so we may get here false conditions false so like we can use here okay not strict operator okay the same thing if you go to here uh, for abstract equality okay and this is for abstract not equal to operator not abstract equal operator not equal abstract not equal operator okay so for this uh, let me take here let x equal to 10 so i'm taking your uh, string literals this is a numerical letter and similar let okay let string equal to uh, i'm taking here 10 okay so both times uh, both types are not equal like this is a number this is a string literal okay when i'm comparing this value here console.log okay so i may compare here both x double equal to str str okay so you may you may expect here true value because we are using abstract equality let's zero this reload this page so we are getting false condition okay so here we are getting this true value this is one okay and if you want to see this one so i may place here so we'll get here true value okay this is abstract equality and the same thing if you want to make it this false condition so because uh, both are different types if you want to use this one so we use a strict equality operator okay for strict equality operator i'm just using here same example i'm just using console.log okay for strict equality operator so the same i'm copy and i can paste it here probably equal to okay now it returns a false condition so go to this the serial this way strict equality will check each and every type here now if you want to make it this true condition we need to convert this into number okay so i am convert this into number then i will use this uh, strict equality operator okay to convert this number so we use here console.log okay console.log i may use here x triple equal to number okay so number i may write here a string okay then it will give you a true value okay so like we can use here strict equality operator okay and the same thing we also have um, strict not equal to operator 
Now can strict not equal to operator. The same conditions. Okay. So here we are taking that. Uh, I may take here the same condition here. And I would like to write here. not equal to operator so we may get here false false condition same same thing we may we may write like this we can copy this and we can paste it here so we may get here this is also false condition okay so next we have a greater than operator example So for greater than operator, console.log. So I may take your um, 60 greater than 30. Okay, you may get true conditions here. True condition. You may get here false condition, like we can use here false 160 so go to this browser just reload this page like you can get true and false value okay and we can also compare with this console.log okay compare we can compare this one here there be city greater than like this okay so you may use this string value obviously it will give you a true value here let me use this one probably you may get here true value okay and if you use uh, rather than that you may get false condition okay so like we can use here greater than up same we can also use a less than operator here for less than we can use console.log Okay, so I may take here file as on file. So you may get here false condition. Similarly, so I may get here yen. May get the false condition. And we'll we'll take the same example here. A B C. So I may take here BB. So you may get here true condition because A, ABC is bigger than this BB characters. Okay, so like we can use here a comparison operators in JavaScript.